Hey guys, welcome back. I am your host Jennifer. Today in this podcast we're talking about React.js development and four common interview questions you may encounter. First off, a React.js developer is someone who specializes in using the React JavaScript library to build user interfaces. They use components, state management, and other tools to create interactive and dynamic web applications. Now, let's move on to the interview questions. Question 1. What is your experience with React.js? Sample answer. I have been working with React.js for about three years now. During that time, I have built several projects using React, including a social media platform and an e-commerce website. I am comfortable with using components, managing state, and integrating with APIs. Question 2. How do you handle performance issues in React.js? Sample answer. I always prioritize performance in my projects. One technique I use is code splitting, which allows me to load only the necessary components for each page. I also optimize my code by using pure components and memoization to reduce unnecessary re-renders. Question 3. Can you explain the concept of virtual DOM in React.js? Sample answer. The virtual DOM is a lightweight representation of the actual DOM, React uses it to efficiently update the UI without having to manipulate the real DOM directly. When there is a change in the state or props of a component, React compares the virtual DOM with the previous version and only updates the necessary parts. Question 4. How do you handle state management in large-scale React.js applications? Sample answer. For larger applications, I prefer using Redux for state management. It allows for a centralized store of data that can be easily accessed and updated by different components. I also use Redux middleware like Thunk or Saga to handle asynchronous actions and side effects. That's it for today's video, guys. Thanks for tuning in and don't forget to like and subscribe for more tech tips and tricks.